Now, today we will see activities on page number 20. So, here the first activity is given. The location of the orthocenter of a triangle. So, we have to find the location in different types of the triangle. So, first activity is given that draw a right angle triangle and draw all its altitudes and write the point of concurrence. So, this is the first activity. And now I'll draw a right angle triangle. How to draw? See? Draw one with the, any one segment with the, any major. Now I'll take a protractor. With the protractor, I'll take 90 degree. See? At this point, I'll give the name here. A, B. And at exact A point, I'll keep the protractor. Center and I will take 90 degree and join it with the scale. So this will be my point C, 90 degree and now I will join ABC. So this is a right angle triangle. Now we have to draw the uh, perpendicular that is altitude we have to draw so altitude means what we have seen the definition that a perpendicular drawn from the vertex to its opposite base or the opposite side is called the altitude so here i'll take per first vertex c opposite of c is ab okay and if you observe in right angle triangle from c already perpendicular is drawn on ab so, this is our first altitude. Now, we will take point B. Now, vertex B and opposite side is CA or AC. And on the AC, if you observe again 90 degree symbol, that means from vertex B, already perpendicular or the altitude is drawn from B to AC. So, this two we don't have to draw. Now, the third one. Third vertex is A. And the opposite side is BC. So, we can draw now this altitude. So, again take a set square. And how I said? Uh, arrange your set square along with one side of a right angle. And the BA point along with the second side of right angle. Arrange it properly. And carefully draw it. This is the altitude. So, here see, suppose D point. Now, if you observe, this is one altitude. This is second altitude. And now, this is the third altitude. And all three altitudes intersect at point A. So, this A point is nothing but the orthocenter of a triangle. A is the point A. Is the orthocenter of a right angle triangle? So, this is a first activity. Now, what is the second activity? We will see activity 2. So now, I will read activity for you. You all have to pay attention in your textbook. First they said, draw an obtuse angle triangle and draw all its altitudes. Do they intersect each other? That we will draw and we will check it. Draw the lines containing the altitudes. Observe that these lines are concurrent. So we will observe that. So first, I will take one scale and I will draw the obtuse angle triangle. So, you know, obtuse angle triangle means what? One angle is up greater than 90 degree. So, here I will draw a line with any major. So, I will write here B, C and uh, this side I will take opposite. That is 90 above. Okay. And then draw it. 
join it. Now this vertex I'll give A name. So this is a obtuse angle triangle. Now we will draw the altitudes of each. Now see altitude means vertex and its opposite side. So if you see if I draw the perpendicular it is going outside of the triangle. So what I'll do I'll extend this BC to the other side. No, I'll make one arrow here and now see again our set square we have to arrange so now I'll arrange like this so the side along with this and the vertex along with the other side so this is what altitude uh, now I will draw with the second, this is the altitude from A to BC. Now I will draw the altitude from B to AC opposite. So now again I have to arrange this set square. So see AC along with this right angle and the vertex B. So see I have arranged it one side along with BC and other side along with, uh, sorry one side along with AC. And other side along with B. And now I will draw it. Carefully all I have to draw. Extend it up to the base. Now this is 90 degree. Okay. Now see. If I extend this side then this will not be intersect. Okay. So to intersect these two. What I have to do. I have to extend this altitude to the other side that is from B. So I will extend this and also I will extend this altitude. Now this finish from doing A vertex from B vertex. Now I will do from C. So this is the C vertex and opposite of C is A. B side is given. So now see how to arrange. One side is along with C and other side is along with AB. So I will keep like this first and then I will go down so that it will not be wrong. But here I can find the segment is not there. So I will extend this AB segment. See with the scale you can extend. So I will write this B little bit small or little bit aside. So now we will draw the altitude from point C to segment BC. So for that we have already extended this. Now see how to draw. So for that I will arrange this set square. And see one side along with AB and other side along with C. Now I will join it. Now I will join it. So you have to take care when you are drawing it. It should be perfectly come. And now I will extend this. If I extend. previous point of intersection. So here I will give the arrows, I will give the O. So when it is uh, C, I will write it here perpendicular. Now ABC, I will give the name AP, here P, this is Q and this is R. So see students, if we draw the obtuse angle triangle and if we draw the altitudes of a obtuse angle triangle that alt altitudes also intersect at one point that means that these altitudes are concurrent and so this O will be the ortho center so this is the ortho center where we got the ortho center we got the ortho center outside of this obtuse angle triangle see for right angle triangle we got the ortho center exactly at the 
90 degree angle and now for obtuse angle triangle, ortho center we got out of the triangle.